Hey, welcome back to the channel. Coming up next, I have some Hobbit Series 2 blind bags for you, so stay tuned. These are, of course, The Hobbit, The Desolation of Smaug. I'm really excited to open these. I wasn't expecting to find them as they were a little late over here. I think the store I got them in might have forgot about them because they had them marked down quite a lot when I saw them. So there is one figure, one base, and one collector file in each one of these bags. They are ages four and up. I really enjoyed the movie when it came out. Uh, be sure and let me know what you thought of the movie in the comments below. I'm excited to see who's in this, so I'm going to crack on and open number one. On this sheet, I think you can see the rares on the front. There's actually a clear Bilbo Baggins, a different version Gandalf, and a Thorin Oakenshield. And these are the regular ones that you can get. I'm unsure if you can get a gold, silver, or bronze in this. In series one, that's how they were with gold being the most rare. It looks like they might just all be silver this time around. And we got this awesome Radagast. He is so silvery. I think he might actually be more silver than last time. Really, really incredibly detailed, amazing figure. Now these are just static figures. They have one pose. You cannot move them. But the base does come separate and you can see their nameplate on the front there etched into the base. Really, really nice. I like this fella. Hopefully we'll get two different ones for the other two bags. Let's see. Here goes pack number two. Next up we have this amazing looking figure. This is Killy the Dwarf. Again, the base is separate and the sword is separate, I'm assuming, so it doesn't get warped. They're kind of hard. They aren't made out of actual silver. It looks just to be painted on. I love how it looks a little weathered. It is really, really cool. What do you think of it? Be sure and let me know in the comments below. And on to pack number three. We got Bofar the Dwarf, and he is amazing. I really love the finish on these, and I'm pretty certain I was right. There is no bronze, gold, or silver just in these ones. There's just the different three rares. Originally, like I said, you could get a different color for each one, but I love this finish. I think it's fantastic, so the three tones is not really needed for these. Be sure and let me know who your favorite is in the comments below. I think for grandness sake, Radagast would definitely have to be my favorite for the figures here. And I'd say from the movie, Killy was probably my favorite. So if you enjoyed that, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. And I will see you all next time. And if you want, consider donating to my Patreon. You can donate as little as a dollar per video that I make, and that helps me keep the channel running. So I will see you all next time. Later, guys.